My name is Ricardo Aca. I am from Puebla, Mexico, and I work in the Trump Soho building. When Mexico sends its people, they're not sending their best. They're sending people that have lots of problems. They're bringing drugs, they're bringing crime, they're rapists. I've worked at the Trump Soho for the past two years. I'm a buster at the only restaurant in the hotel. This is not what I plan on doing with my life, but I work really hard and I definitely don't take it for granted. Are you a criminal? I am not a criminal. Are you a drug dealer? Not a drug dealer. Are you a rapist? Definitely not a rapist. I'm an undocumented immigrant. I was about 14 when I crossed the border. I came here with my family, my stepfather, my mom, and my sister. We live in Bushwick, Brooklyn. We've lived here for the last nine, almost 10 years. This is where I went to high school. This is where all of my friends are. It's home to me. I feel like Republicans think Mexicans are lazy. But I personally work two jobs. My stepfather works two jobs. Everything that my family has, and like we have earned it by working. We came to America because we wanted a better life. My mom was able to put me and my sister through college, which I'm not so sure if, if, if in Mexico I would have been able to do that. I received my associate's degree in commercial photography. It's something that I've always had an eye for and that I think I'm really good at. I'm very passionate about it. It also gives me a voice. I can't bold, but I can take photos and share the stories of people like me. You know, Trump keeps pointing out all these immigrants that have done all these terrible things. But those aren't the immigrants that I know. That's not what we're like. And photography is a way for me to show that. Other Republicans have criticized Trump's comments, but to me they all seem to have the same position on immigration. I mean, I may have an accent, but I'm not stupid. And I know I could lose my job just for talking about Trump, but it doesn't make me proud to go to work every day under his name. I don't think the rest of America feels the same way that he does. I hope that they don't. I love it here, I love New York City. I feel as much part of this country as anybody else, but I'm also proud to be Mexican.